Good morning guys, hope everyone's doing okay. So, my shopping's just arrived, look at it. Oh, does anyone want to come help me put it away? Because I hate putting shopping away. What I'm going to do, I'm going to do a little haul with you, because I haven't done a shopping haul for a long while. So, I'm going to organise it all in the kitchen, and then I'll show you what I've bought. So, catch up with you in a bit. Right, hallway is nearly clear apart from these two so I've got a case of Stella and a case of hot, pie slot, hot house lager I thought my husband might not want to say different um, <clears throat> they're just they'll last us for ages because we don't drink a lot of lager I just like to have some lager in the house in case um, anyone wants the lager really so I've usually got spirits and, and soft drinks but um, I just needed to get some more lager and they were two for twenty so I'm going to leave them to my husband to actually put away so look at look at all this good job it's recycling day today i'm going to use some of these bags so i keep some because they're really handy for different things so it was a big shop oh, i'm not looking forward to finding places to put all this so i have started slimming world <clears throat> um you're gonna see wet hair now sorry i've had a shower and then i didn't dry my hair um, so I've started Slimming World uh, two days ago, so I just needed to get bits and pieces for that. It is quite expensive um, to do Slimming World, I think it is, because fruit and veg sometimes, if it's not on offer or you can't get great deals, it can be quite pricey. And most of it is like your speed foods and things like that. I have done it before and I asked about stone. I am only wanting to lose £8. So... I've put on eight pounds since I come back from Florida, a little bit of weight during the lovely spring, winter slash spring we've had. So um, I just wanted to um, lose that eight pound because before long that eight pound, that'll turn into a stone. And once you get to that extra stone that you've put on it's even harder. So I'm hoping that I'm going to be able to get it done by the end of this month um, because we're going away in June. So I've got a, a goal to get it done by hopefully the end of this month it's only eight pound and then i'll probably if i'm happy i'll carry on doing it so i'm going to show you my haul there are some naughty bits here but um they're not all for me they're for my husband as well so let's get started make a cup of tea because there's lots here i'm gonna put the kettle on and then just like have a cup of tea and watch what i've just spent all my well-earned money on i think it come to about a hundred pound um, that was with my staff discount as well so it's quite a bit of money but it should last me a while so and I've got a spare fridge downstairs which I can put all my bits and pieces in so I haven't just got um, ram it all in my fridge up here so when it's more spaced out in a fridge it lasts longer right let's get going stop waffling Eileen so let's start so I'm going to start over here first so I'm hoping I've bought the right ones I will have to check with my friends so they're the mug shots and I've got the chicken and sweet corn, tomato and herb, um, because they're really good for a quick lunch. Um, especially at the weekend, I might want something quick. And I think they're free. I'm mean, going to have to check, but I think they're free. My husband, I always treat him to one pot noodle a week. And he likes the Bombay bad boy, because they're really bad for you. Same as these. They're not good for you. They're great for a, a quick snack at the weekend if we're, we're busy. Or if he just wants um, a... a a hot a hot lunch um, but doesn't want to cook too much so they're really handy uh, fruity puffs obviously they're not for me these are for my granddaughter she loves them and if i buy a big bag she loves quavers and she loves what's it but if i buy those i know i'm going to be tempted to have a bag and my husband definitely will be tempted to have a bag so these we won't eat these are her snacks so she's got the strawberry and she's got the blueberry and they're um, they're organic so they're, they're a lot better for her than um, the other crisps so they're just so if we go out the weekend marshmallows I've bought three packs of marshmallows I'm gonna have to sin those I think they're one I think they're one sit one sin each but these are smaller so maybe I might get away with two sins each I'm gonna have to find out about those some inspired couscous, Moroccan couscous. It's got spices, char grilled peppers in. That's really nice just to put on top. But I may have to sin that as well. So I've got to have a look to see how many sins that is. Um, because I think they put oil and things in it. It's 6.5 grams of fat. So I may have to sin 
when I use it. Um, every day, fa oh my phone's going, I'll come back to you. Okay, sorry I'm back, that was my daughter, she's got something for me though, that's interesting. Um, so I bought the family pack cooked ham. So this um, is good just if you just want to eat it like by itself. And then I've bought um, the crumbed ham at the bottom. That's a more expensive ham. Um, so that's nicer for like dinners and um, if I want a nice sandwich. Um, yogurts, I've bought the Muller Light, two strawberry, two smooth toffee, two banana and custard. And my husband likes these ones. I'm not that keen on these. The banana and chocolate and the vanilla chocolate balls. I've also bought these. I'm hoping they're free. It says light and free and they're done on. And they're 0% fat and no added sugar. Um, so I'm hoping they're free. They're um, coconut grey, so I may have to sin those. Um, some petty falou for my granddaughter. when she has her luck dinners here over the weekend. And um, a selection of cheese. So I didn't buy one big bag of cheese. I thought, you know what, I, I love cheese. So I thought these can be um, uh, an, at one of my A boxes. So it's got all different. It's got Applewood, Eichester, Edam, Charlesburg, Baby Bell. Um, it's just got a really nice selection of cheeses in there. So I thought they'd be really good. And they're about the size that I'm allowed to have on my um, A, I think it's my A box or my B box. I have to have a look. I know it's one of them. So if I, um, because I actually use uh, almond milk, which I, I'm going to sin if I use my almond milk. So there's my almond milk. I've got, I haven't got um, a, da a dairy intolerance, but I do find if I have a lot of milk, I do get an upset tummy. So, and if I have almond milk or coconut milk, I don't. Oh, I forgot to show you my um, seafood sticks. So they're really great for snacking on and putting in salads and stuff, sorry. Um, so fry light, obviously it's a staple when you're on the slimming world. Uh, jalapenos, they're for my husband, I cannot stand them. Tomato ketchup, that's for my husband and my granddaughter, I can't stand ketchup, ooh, ooh, I don't like it. Um, tin peas, I love peas, my granddaughter loves peas, she'll spend like ages eating peas off of um, her for lunch etc. Pickled onions, I'm not really a great pickled onion fan. But um, I thought if I want to put one with a salad or something. A fat-free vinaigrette dressing, um, which looks really nice actually. So that one looks nice. Some garlic salt. Um, I want garlic salt because I want to just prep up some things. I make the Slimming World chips and they'll be great for that. And also I've bought um, the uh, chip seasoning as well, paprika and onion. I thought that would be nice just to, if I do my um, do any chicken or anything like that. Um, cherry coke I bought the mango one last week uh, last time um, and it was really nice but I thought I'd do the feisty cherry it looks really nice and I think I have tried this one before and it's lovely so freezer some cod fillets obviously um, I won't be having breaded cod but also I could put some of this paprika sauce on the top or some garlic sauce or even um, grate up some of my cheese from my, my, um, my um, allowance and put that on the top Potato lattices are not for me, they're for my husband and for my granddaughter. I don't like anything like that really. A big pack of pork loin steaks. This was really reasonable, I think it was only like £3.50, which I'm going to split into different packs. Um, chicken legs, which obviously I will take the skin off, um, which I'm going to split into two packs. These are, um, We're going to have one of um, these each for Sunday lunch, a great size just for us too, if I want to do a Sunday roast, but I will take the skin off. Fish fingers, obviously everyone has to have fish fingers in their um, freezer. And I bought uh, Woodside um, Gammon Steaks. They look quite nice actually. They're the smoked ones, but I will trim all the fat off of those. So, And I like that with um, some pineapple, which I've just remembered I forgot to order. Never mind, I can get some pineapple. Oh no, I've got fresh pineapple. Duh. Okay, so coming over here. Um, look at my fruit bowl, it looks really sad. It won't do shortly, it's going to be really full up. So Felix for my putty cat, uh, tenor lights for, you. well you know, we're all getting old. Um, Daz two, uh, three in one, this was five pounds for 42, it's the whites and colours one, which I thought was really good. So, and I love the smell of Daz. 
Um, a Comfort Intense. Now, I thought this bottle was going to be bigger than that. It says 38 washes. So maybe I actually do put too much in when I do my wash. So I'm just going to use that as it tells you to. Jumbo Kitchen Roll. Now, I bought the Aldi's Kitchen Roll a few weeks ago. It must have been about three weeks ago. Let me see if I can show you. Excuse the state of my conservatory. Look, you can tell. Look at this weather. Hello, spring. Summer arrived last weekend and then disappeared again. So this is spring. Look, windy. My chickens are even hiding. You can't actually see them down there because they're hiding out of the wind. And look. It's just really sad. I might actually bring, have to bring that plant in. That is a Satsuma plant. And we've got loads and loads of buds on it. And if it gets any colder, I think we might have to bring it in just till it warms up again. Paddling pool. Yeah, we did have nice weather. Look, paddling pool's out. Washing. <laughs> and up here is what I come out here to show you. So it's the... You can't really see it properly. It was the Aldi's Ultra kitchen roll. That is the best kitchen roll i have ever bought it is so thick and i think a roll has lasted and i use kitchen roll a lot because i use it a lot for when nova's here and spillages and for polishing for windows and glass and it's lasted so long but i can't get to all these until probably the weekend so i will pick another one up when i go to all these so it's a really good kitchen roll so at the moment i've got the jumbo one and this one's pretty good as well that's well so going on to my veg, look at this. Veg, 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 veg. Fruit, 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 fruit. <laughs> so I've got pineapple, which is a speed. Two packs of piccolo tomatoes, I can snack on those. Peppers, I've got a pack of pepper and I've got another red pepper because I'm going to bulk up my dinners with peppers. They are speed. Spring onions, a melon baby spinach which I'm going to add to my salads and I'm just going to try and add it to all my my dinners really because um, it doesn't last long it's a fresh and naked one and it won't last long some uh, little baby potatoes only 59p and these are quite nice radishes they're on offer as well they're only 59p bananas I hope I didn't buy too many bananas because I've already got a few bananas some carrots uh, I don't buy loads of carrots at a time. I have got frozen carrots in the freezer, but um, I'm going to probably do these so that I can snack on them. Uh, corn cob, satsumas, onions, and I'll probably need more onions than that. And a bag of salad, and I probably will have to replay my salad during the week. Two um, closed cut mushrooms, because I'll be bulking out a lot of my meals with mushrooms. Empire apples, they look really nice. I think I've got empire apples, um, a big bag of potatoes, and I probably will have to buy more potatoes, depending on what we cook. If I have a lot of salads, maybe not. And um, strawberries. I can normally get strawberries at quite a reasonable price from work, but I want some uh, because we've just run out and I don't go back to work till tomorrow, so strawberries. I always look for strawberries in my staff shop. Someone hasn't picked great quality on my satsumas but I'll probably eat that one first but they are really not that great but they're okay we'll eat them quite quickly so they're not great quality but they'll eat them but everything else is really good I'm really happy so yeah that is my just pan it round Tesco shop and now I've got to put it all away does anyone want to come help me I'll make you a cup of tea or coffee don't just hate putting shopping away. I think I'm going to deal with me children that first. Split my packs into separate packs. I've still got some. I'm going to find a recipe for my aubergine. I've still got a bit in my veg rack. Ignore the crisps at the bottom. They are not getting eaten um, by me. I have got like pea snacks down there. But they're not mine. I won't be eating them. And I'm just going to have a look to see actually how much it comes to. Just to let you know. Give you an idea. I do get staff discounts, so I get 10% off. Um, so the whole, I haven't got my glasses on, so this going to be interesting. Uh, oh, so the whole lot, the whole lot comes to 104 pounds and 48 pence. Oh, good job I've got a table to hang on to. My shopping has not come to that for a long, long while. My shopping sometimes only comes to 
60, 68 pounds, 70 pound tops. So that is a big shot. But I did get some bits and pieces like cleaning stuff and that onto that. And hopefully it will last me um, quite a while and I won't have to do another shot until next week. So I hope you enjoyed this haul. Please excuse my hair. I will dry my hair eventually. Um, please, you know, like and subscribe if you enjoyed this haul. I do do um, a few hauls now and again. I mainly post my holidays. Um, my next holiday is Salu on the 1st of June. So I shall take you with me to Salu. Um, hopefully the Wi-Fi is good in the hotel and I can do some short vlogs, uh, short ones. Um, if not, I'll do them when I come home. So yeah, so like and subscribe please and like, leave a comment. I like to read your comments and I do try and reply to comments. Um, I do work full time so it's really difficult sometimes because of the hours that I work. So I do get round to it. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. And uh, if you want to help me come put this away, I'll be grateful actually. Can't wait for my daughter to come around and she can help me. <laughs> Have a great, have a great week, everybody. Thanks for watching. Bye.